the use of the ear reaches perfection when connected with hari katha and the use of the tongue achieves its perfection when speaking krishna katha there was a, a businessman who was having a, a parrot in his house and this man would regularly go and visit some bhagavat katha and hear constantly every single day and this katha was happening for several days and he would come back and share a few things from the katha along with his family members so this parrot was listening and the parrot spoke one day to this owner he said every day you are going to the katha and coming back i am within this cage in this house i have a question for the speaker of the katha you know the parrot was interested in a question answer session <laughs> but he was within the cage so the parrot said can you go and ask this question on my behalf to the bhagavat kathakar to the speaker so this man was also very happy that oh every day my realizations i am sharing has inspired some interest within this parrot so i am also a good kathakar so he looked at the parrot and said okay definitely i'll do that what's your question so the parrot said please ask the speaker how i can escape from this cage so the man was also very happy that oh he is very intelligent he is thinking about his future so he said definitely i'll ask so after the katha that day this man asked the speaker of the bhagavatam i have a parrot in the house and he has a question for you that how he can escape from this cage immediately at that time the speaker of the bhagavatam fell on the ground unconscious and this guy was totally bewildered and all the other disciples came and started putting water on this kathakar and you know after long time they revived him this man came back totally bewildered says what was so wrong about my question and what was so shocking about my question did i commit an offense what did i do so he was totally confused so when he came back the parrot said did you get the answer and he said yeah actually what happened was when i asked the question as soon as i asked the question how can the parrot escape the speaker fell on the ground unconscious so he couldn't give an answer and i am also bewildered so maybe tomorrow i'll ask the question again the parrot said don't worry i got the answer next day morning when this man got up and came near the cage he saw that the parrot was dead so he was taken aback he said are yesterday the sadhu fell down and after i spoke here now the parrot is gone what is going on and he opened the cage as soon as he opened the cage the parrot flew away <laughs> when the parrot flew away the man got bewildered he felt cheated he came running to the kathakar and he said what is going on here is there some conspiracy he said no you asked me the question how can the parrot escape and i just fell down without speaking the words you could not understand what it meant the parrot understood <laughs> you have been attending the katha every day for 13 days you could not get it without attending live even single katha he understood because he had the intelligence <laughs> so hearing is not a matter of how many hours you clock live sitting because you may be sitting and nodding the head but mind may be contemplating something else or one may be coming to katha thinking that you know my sleep enhances <laughs> nashta prayeshu abhadreshu all anxieties are released so the essence is that we have to understand the purpose of why we are hearing this <laughs> 